All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye. I never liked you, Lewis. You're a vindictive, sniveling rat, but I never thought you'd betray your own firm. I've never betrayed this firm. What do you call helping Allison Holt poach our associates? I had nothing to do with that. I love this firm, Harvey. You were a traitor when you voted for Hardman, and you're a traitor now. Like I've told you before, I'm not the only one in this firm who voted for Hardman, and I voted to oust him once I knew. Once you knew, you had to save your own ass. All right, you know what, Harvey? Just get out. Get out. I did nothing wrong. Jesus! You bugged my office. You ran to Hardman about the CM lawsuit. You sold your soul for senior partnership. And once you got it, you created a drug policy with the sole purpose of firing me. I did it for Hardman. Maybe Hardman wanted me dead, but you're the one who went out, got the gun, aimed it, and fired it at my head. And it blew up in my face. And what would have happened if it didn't? I was under orders. Were you also under orders when you ran to Hardman about Monica Eaton? How do you know it was me? Because I set it up! Because I know who you are! Are you still gonna tell me you're not helping Allison? Harvey, I swear to God I did not do this. Maybe not, but now that you've done what you've done, I will never trust you. Pearson Hardman is my life. Well, here's what's gonna happen from now on. You and I, we're done. Don't drop by my office. Don't ask Donna for information. You're the guy that nobody wants, but we can't get rid of. But I'm seeing your partner. So I can't make you leave. But as far as I'm concerned, you don't even work here anymore. 